everyone and welcome back to another episode of Alpha Craft with me, JCB. Oh, look what we've been doing. I actually uh, built these little huts um, a little bit before Christmas, but uh, only got around to showing them now because uh, we've been doing so many other things with the with the other alphas and it's been a lot of fun. Um, but unfortunately, it does mean that my base has been uh, neglected. Um, so you'll probably hear some uh, some zombie noises coming from this hut. Uh, these guys are indisposed at the moment. Uh, I've got one of uh, Big Meanie's boys in there um, just renegotiating um, sales prices. Um, so we'll, we'll leave them to that for now. <laughs> um, what I'm doing is just setting up um, a couple more uh, traders in here. We haven't... Um, the big, big Meanie's... Uh, associate hasn't been to see this guy yet uh, but I thought it'd be very useful to have a couple of the other villagers not just the librarians and it also links the village uh, to the trading hall too and uh, I mean it's still not looking too alive but I mean that was the look I was going for I suppose I mean you know ignore the uh, <laughs> ignore the minecart rails there <laughs> because uh, that is just temporary that's just there for for a function but the whole idea with this village is that everything's sort of hidden you have to get up close to it oh oh there we go there's uh oh we've had one, one transformation yeah yeah it's always it's always good to have uh, a second one uh but yeah oh yeah and we had a, a creeper blow up here about two minutes before i started recording that's just ugh, typical really is um yeah we we like to get up close and personal to the builds uh, the the whole idea with this village is that it's hidden away and you have to you have to stroll through it to to really see all of it so that's something i'm in the middle of um i did stream some of it one of my new year's resolutions is to stream more from the alphacraft server i'm also going to be uh streaming some skyblock and um maybe some other games i'm not sure yet um, but make sure you're going and checking out uh, the link for my Twitch channel uh, because it's a lot of fun. I really love uh, streaming. I love getting to interact with everybody and you guys really do make me laugh sometimes. Okay, so the other thing that I did on a live stream, believe it or not, was some redstone and um, we went and got Spando Bally, um, a new uh, a new friend. Now, I don't know if this, if I'm going to be able to show you. No, look, it's already run out of gold. So this thing goes through gold. Uh, so quickly but what I've done is uh, got it so that um, it it turns off so it's going to feed the gold to them um, automatically and I'll show you how in a minute but just check out uh, just check out all this loot look I've got over a stack of the crying obsidian and it even goes over into this chest here and in here we've got lots of stuff oh and I, I think I've been using this as a dump chest because <laughs> they don't they don't give you netherrack that's 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 a lie um, but yeah, we've got lots and lots of these soul speed boots and I do think I'm going to be uh, collecting these up and using these uh, for something really cool at the fun zone, but not just yet. I always say that, don't I? I'm planning on doing something, but not just yet. We're going to do something different today, um, but I'm going to just show you the uh, the redstone really quickly behind, uh, behind the Spando Ballets. If I just get rid of some of this so we can see... I didn't really need to put all this here, did I? No, uh, I was trying to cover it up, and then realised I could have just I I could just put blocks here, and it blocked it up. Anyway, um, all I've done is at the uh, at the back of the hopper, where the piglin throws his uh, items into, I've put a comparator. Then I've put three repeaters all on um, maximum tick, um, so that there's a bit of a delay, and then that just feeds up to the back. Of the dispenser and when there's gold in there um, and I'll turn that on um, he'll get the gold and then he'll throw the items into the hopper that goes into the chest and then after a few seconds it'll spit out more gold at him and that way it's only going to spit gold at them if they uh, if they throw items into the hopper so when there's no gold left it just turns off and then we're not getting lag and we're not getting unnecessary ticks now don't be fooled i did do it on a live stream but and i understand how it works but um oh, i'm opening chests they're going to get annoyed at me uh but it was actually frill who sort of mentioned it 
Um, and I and I just got in there before him. I don't think he's actually played with piglins yet. So it was Phil that said use to use a comparator, but yeah, I, I worked it out all by myself and I'm very pleased with myself. <laughs> so that's that. So I can't show you it working until I've got some more gold. But we're not doing that today either. So JTB, you've showed us all this stuff, but you, you say you're not doing any of that today. No, we're doing something completely different, something that I haven't done on here yet. Um, I would really, really like some beacons for my base. All the celebrations over New Year, taking the potions, you know, we yeah, we, we did some, uh, we, we did a few uh, speed, speed boost potions and, and it was quite nice being able to run around even faster. Um, so let me just, uh, See if I can remember where I'm going. I think I'm going to the West Tunnel. We need to go to the Wither Skeleton Farm uh, because we need lots and lots of skulls because I plan on making quite a lot of beacons. And I'm guessing that this is the tunnel down to it. It's in if we've got a, a Wither Skull there. I've just realized that my inventory is really, really full of, I've got, it's okay, I've got an ender chest on me. Uh, should maybe swap my helmet as well for something gold. So if I get a piglin on my tail, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Probably just chop his head off, but you know, I'll be scared. This is looking promising. Yes, this is it. Wow. Um, I need to get a good look of this thing from the outside because Draymond Smith has um, decorated this. Oh, it's it's absolutely epic. Let, let's just let's have a quick look around first, and then we'll show you. I'll show you the farm. Look at it. It's immense. It is epic. It is just just gothic it's foreboding it's intimidating it is just amazing Draymond smith you really really outdid yourself when you built this this is amazing look at we've got the wither at the end there uh yeah it, it gives me the creeps but at the same time I'm, i can't stop looking at it it's beautiful and scary and then through here we've actually got blaze farm um, I can't remember if I'm supposed to be in here or not, if this is, this is staff only. Uh, let's see if we can get a good look at it from the outside. Oh, look at it. Yes, a dent fly. But just look at the size of it. That's just, it's immense. It really is. Anyway, I'll stop gushing. <laughs> I need to go and get some wither skulls so that we can make lots of beacons. I'm not sure how many. So in here, we get quite a few of the nether mobs, but these uh, iron bars do, for the most part, uh, stop them from seeing you. You just gotta sort of run around here and um, wait for the for the wither skeletons to spawn. Um, I have been sort of, you know, fighting and shooting the uh, the other mobs if I'm not getting too many skeletons, but um, it doesn't take too long at all. Oh, they're there. Yep, there we go. Some of them have spawned. Let's get them so they can see us. So we're like half a block up and because they're two and a half blocks tall, uh, they can actually see us. Oh, I don't need to hit them there though, do I? I need them to follow me over to the killing area so that all their, all their loot falls into the chests. Come along, come along, luring you to your death, skeleton. Mwahaha! You think you're going to kill me? But I know better. And there's plenty of uh, plenty of bones as well. I might take some of those for bone meal. But anyway, we're going to spend some time here to get lots and lots of heads. And then we're going to go and take them uh, to the Wither Killer so that we can put up some beacons. And if I'm feeling really brave, I might even do one that's, you know, not a part of the killer. You know, the, the little killing area. Um, but I haven't decided if I'm feeling brave yet. Dokey. Right, I've come to the milk bar just to stock up on milk. Now, uh, it's, it's not likely that I'm going to be uh, needing milk if I'm using the Wither Killer, um, but uh, I think I am feeling brave, and I'm going to I'm going to do one, you know, the regular way, and, um, and and not use the killer just for one. You know, I'm not I'm not that gung ho, <laughs> um, but just just to say that I've done it properly. 
just once uh, on this server would be uh, would, would be good, I think. So this is my regular uh, this is my regular potions box, and then I've set up a fight the wither box as well. So I've got my skulls. I've got 22. If I did, just stuck around and got another uh, two, um, I'd have had enough for uh, one more beacon. But they were not letting go of their heads willingly. It was uh, it, it was taking a while. So um, I think I've got enough stuff there. I probably should get my chest plate and shield out. Um, but we'll do that after. I'm, it's not, I'm not going to need. I'm not going to need all that stuff. I'm using the killer. But even though I'm going to be using the killer and I should be safe, I'm still quite nervous about it because um, I'm not sure if anybody's used it since uh, since we updated to 116.4. And um, we all know how updates can affect some of the game mechanics. I don't want to be the one to let a wither loose. In, uh, in in the hub, so, um, oh, let's just do it. We can just go for it. It should work. So what we've got here, it's really not um, that that fancy at all. Um, the, the hard part is finding uh, a part of the, the nether roof that has a three by three solid uh, bedrock bit there. It doesn't matter that that's there. It just has to be a three by three solid piece and then two blocks down, uh, we've got, you know, where we're going to be placing the soul sand. And I believe the tail faces west. Now, I know that that was a thing in bedrock. I'm not sure if uh, the tail facing west is a necessity on Java, but, um, but if I was doing this myself, that is how I would set it up. So I'm just gonna place my shulkers down there a bit. I will grab a couple of potions and a couple of things of milk just in case, um, just in case something comes flying at me and, um, you know, I just, oh, I'm, right, just do it, just do it, just do it. Oh, I actually, I actually need the stuff uh, for, for the wither. <laughs> oh, let's do this. Okay, okay, okay. Ready? Three, two, one. I'm doing it, I'm doing it, I'm doing it, I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Ah! <laughs> run away, run away so it doesn't explode me. All the bedrock's in the way. Oh, I think he's stuck. Is he stuck? He doesn't seem to be moving anywhere. He's definitely shooting stuff. He's definitely dying. Uh, but it is taking a little while. Oh, oh, let's just, just, just smack him. Just smack him. Just do it. Oh, I'm so glad it's working. Oh, gosh. Oh, I've just remembered. Oh, the gold farm's up there. What if he's shooting it? Ah! Oh, we'll soon find out. That's it. There's the first one done. Oh, look, I got one of the blue heads. Woohoo! Awesome. That's a scary one. <laughs> That's so cool. Uh, no, now I'm looking. I think it's too far up. There's too much... Too many layers of that. That would not have got the gold farm. <laughs> we maybe shouldn't have built it there. I don't know. But okay, right. Well, I'm going to do a few of these now that I've done the first one and I know that I'm going to be safe. So I'm going to get to chopping some withers. And then when we come back, I'll leave enough for one more and we'll uh, we'll, we'll do one properly and, and set it all up underground and things. There we go, that didn't take long. We've got six nether stars already. All oh, right, they don't spread out. They all just group up. I, it doesn't look like I've got lots. I just want to spread them around so that 
Oh, so I can see how many I've got, but yeah, we've got six. <laughs> okay, so I've left enough for one. Right, let's go back to my base. Let's go find somewhere we can set up to kill the wither. I'm getting scared now. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? This is crazy. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm just going to spend some time trying to find a good spot. Um, I think maybe if I just keep going this way, we'll go way past um, anything that, you know, that I've built. And we won't be in danger of, of ruining anything. But we're quite far under the ground and fighting the wither in Java is a lot easier than it was on Bedrock. And um, this is why I'm so worried about uh, the wither is because um, I'm used to... Uh, the Wither on Bedrock Edition, which is just super OP and, you know, can turn immortal and uh, it can ruin your world. Now, I've actually got a clip from an old video of mine, one of my early videos of me fighting the Wither um, on Bedrock Edition. Now, don't mind the sound quality. It's absolutely rubbish, um, but I'm sure you'll agree um, this this is hilarious. And luckily, I, I actually saved a copy of my world. Check this out. This is why I'm scared. <laughs> don't die, 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 I'm going to die, no, I died. No. The thing like with the skeletons. Okay, well, it looks like none of my stuff actually went uh, in the portal. And now I've got to run through the nether with no protection. <laughs> Should have brought milk. Run, 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 Oh, my goodness. <laughs> now, hopefully, his health bar is going to appear again. There's no health bar. He's immortal. He's immortal. Okay, right, right, quit. Save and quit, save and quit, save and quit. Let's see if that works. Oh, is it going to work? <gasps> Where is he? What? What happened to it? That just, that, that doesn't make sense. Oh, why you hate me, Minecraft? Oh, I hope he didn't go through the portal. No. No, surely not. I don't look. <laughs> We're gonna have to look. Please no, please no, please no, please no. Okay. Oh no, he is, he's in there! Oh no! <laughs> and he's still immortal, oh my god! The world is done for! Ah! <laughs> oh my god! Ah! The world is done for! Ah! <laughs> it's not happening! It's a motto! So do you see? Do you see why I'm scared? <laughs> oh my goodness well um anyway i'm gonna spend some time preparing this area and um i'll come back to you when we're about to start Set up a little area with a bed and everything just in case I die. I'm not sure that it's far enough away um, from that chamber, but it's too late now. I've done it. I thought if I put some potions in this chest, um, it's that I'm, it's less likely that I'm going to lose my shulker box. So I'm just going to grab a couple of each of the things out of here. A couple of regen, got milks. Um, 
oh yeah, I found some diamonds as well. And I thought I uh, should get some night vision because um, he's probably going to destroy all my torches. And let's just get rid of all this, this rubbish out of there. Then the last thing I'm going to try, and I don't know if he will spawn with the water around him, but I'm just going to try it just in case. I don't want him to start making a big crater in the floor and me falling down it every time I come to try and get him. So just thinking of little things like that and uh, the, the water should stop the uh, the, his, the bombs from, uh, from breaking the floor. That is if the bricks don't work. But <laughs> we'll see. I'm just trying some stuff out. Okay, let's have my night vision now. And then uh, we'll be able to see should be able to reach oh my goodness guys are we ready i think i'm gonna die a few times here oh here we go oh, oh my goodness get back get back get back get back oh wait for the explosion oh oh i'm so scared right now oh look he's broken all the bricks no it didn't work no worries it's fine let's just let's just let's just get in while we can let's just do what we can i'm not gonna edit any of this i'm just gonna <laughs> see what silly things i say um while doing this thing oh he's coming through he's coming through he's coming through oh he's already at half health that's cool that's cool okay 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 we can maybe do this maybe oh he's right there come get me come get me <laughs> ah! <laughs> Oh my goodness, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't think my spectral arrow worked. Oh, 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 he's, the, he's got the shield thing. Now I have to actually hit him with the sword. Come on. <laughs> ah, he's right there, he's right there, he's right there, he's coming. Oh, try not to get hit with the wither effect. Oh, oh, all the bombs, all the bombs. Oh, the bombs. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> okay, I've nearly got him. I've nearly got him. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm really scared. Don't, don't, don't get overconfident. Don't get overconfident. Don't ever get overconfident. Don't get overconfident. Don't get overconfident. Ah! How many times can I say that? <laughs> oh, I did it! That was, like, really easy. I don't think I even got hit once. I didn't even get the wither effect once. Oh yeah, baby, check me out. Let's see what kind of mess he's made over here. Wasn't too bad, actually. Um, a lot of the bricks still there. Yeah, we just, just minimum damage, minimum damage. Oh, now, now we've done it. I'm not scared anymore. Yay, ta-da. Okay, right, let's go sell up some beacons. Woohoo! I've got beacons! I, I forgot I actually had one um, that Ginger Ninja gave me a little while ago. Um, so I had eight in total, so I've managed to set up two at four different points. And it's amazing! I can run in between uh, in between bases. Don't have to keep using my light trail, though I'm using it now. Um, uh, just, uh, uh, don't die. I died a couple of times setting those up because I've put them all the way down. Uh, a really low Y level. But guys, I'm going to leave you with some replay footage but when I've uh, when I've run down here a little bit. Whee! So fast! Um, some replay footage of uh, my base at night time with all the beacons lit up. It looks absolutely beautiful. But that is all I've got time for for this episode. If you did enjoy it, make sure to smash that like button. And if you're new to the channel, hit subscribe and press the bell button for all notifications of future videos. Make sure as well that you're checking down in the description for all the social media links. I'm on Twitter and Facebook and Discord. And make sure you're checking out the other Alphas content too. They have some great videos on their channels. And once again, a great big thank you to all my patrons and everybody who supports the channel. It really means the world to me that you guys enjoy watching my videos. There'll be some cards at the end of the screen if you want to watch more. But until the next video, guys, I'll see you then. Thanks for watching.